my father, my spiritual father, my mentor, senior prophet T.B. Joshua. One of the people that he ministered to and God put it in that person's heart, that person looked, how can I pay this man? And the person brought a car to give to him. And on that faithful day, in the morning, in the service, he announced that who among us here can say he's the most proud. And he was led by the Spirit to give the car to this woman that you're about to watch. Good morning, people of God. God bless you all. Thank you, Jesus, for another day. Thank you, Father, for today. We thank you. Thank you. Thank you for everything. It is well with you. It is well with your soul. It is well with you. It is well with your career. It is well with you. It is well with everything that has to do with you in Jesus Christ's name. Amen. I still remain your brother, Prophet Peter, a guilty. Right here in Texas, Dallas. God bless you all. I want you and I to take a step back, to take a step back, looking into our heart of giving, looking into our heart of giving. How have you been giving? Are you giving what you don't need or are you giving what your life cherish most? And I'll be taking you all back to the early 90s when my father, my spiritual father, my mentor, senior prophet T.B. Joshua started his ministry. One of the people that he ministered to and go put it in that person's heart, that person looked, how can I pay this man? Okay, this man does not have no car. He must need a car. And the person brought a car to give to him. <laughs> yes, he said that he has no car, he must need a car. And the person brought a car to give to him. Bringing the car to give to him, he took the car. And on that faithful day, in the morning, in the service, he announced that who among us here can say he's the most proudest. Wretched person here. And people came out. And he was led by the Spirit to give the car. To this woman that you're about to watch. This is nothing but a what? A total art of love, art of faith, art of love. This is what you and I as a Christian need to be doing. Giving what our life depends on. What we cherish most. Giving it to others because the Bible makes us understand. He said, Love your neighbor as thou say. Love your neighbor as yourself. If you love your neighbor as yourself, that means what you can take, you can do it to your neighbor. What you don't need, you don't need to give it to your neighbor. Watch this video with me and tell me in the comment what you learned from that. And I pray that God will open up your hearts to be able to give more, to be able to support, to be able to help people that need help around you, in your family, in your community, in your nation, in Jesus' name. Amen.